Gustav Klimt was an Austrian symbolist painter and one of the most prominent members of the Vienna Secession Movement. The majority of his works include paintings, murals, and pencil sketches, and the primary subject of Klimt's art is the female body. Klimt was born in Austria in 1862, but he died at the age of 55 in the year of 1918. While he grew up in poverty, he eventually worked his way up to becoming a highly regarded artist after some time. While his work reflects aspects of glimmering gold and decoration, it was also seen as controversial because of nudity. Klimt was famous for using gold leaf in many of his paintings, and nowadays those paintings are incredibly valuable. The Vienna Secession was an art movement that was founded in 1897. Gustav Klimt was one of the three major founders. This art movement did not have a specific and particular style, but it reflected the use of geometrical, ornamental, and abstract practices in both art and architecture. Artists in the Vienna Secession were known for rejecting historical traditions and moving forward creatively. The style of Vienna Secession is definitely recognizable in Klimt's artwork. Gustav's painting, entitled Adele Blotchbauer I from 1907, just sold for $135 million at auction. This painting reflects the Vienna Secession style with its decorative gold embellishments, geometric, and ornamental shape. The woman in the painting is dressed rather conservatively, which is a little bit of a change-up for the usual nudity seen in Klimt's artwork. The Kiss is one of Gustav Klimt's most notable works. Once again, this piece reflects Klimt's use of gold leaf embellishments to add an ornamental and decorative touch. The painting shows simple love between a man and woman, and love is a way of showing bliss and breaking away from historical and societal expectations. This beautiful painting is simple yet meaningful. Water Serpents II is an ornamental oil painting of two women who are nude and surrounded by colorful and unconventional shapes and lines. The title and the sense of movement in this piece portray the feeling that the subjects are surrounded by water. At this time, showing life forms underwater was a way for artists like Klimt to articulate the unexploited transcendental universes of humans rather than the strict beliefs and traditions that history tells us. The side and back profiles of these women show a streamlined sense of movement within this piece. Hope Gangloff is an artist inspired by Gustav Klimt, and she is currently working in New York City. Her art reflects the values, tones, and body types as seen in Klimt's work. Her art focuses on people and a realistic representation of them, with contrast between bright popping reds and more muted cool tones as the foundation of most of her art. The proportions of her work seem balanced in the same way that Klimt balanced the figures in his art. 